my mom said you needed volunteers, so I volunteered. Oh. Finally got the charity bug? You sound surprised. No, not really. You were always a giver. Would you knock it off? My mom's right over there. Have a seat. You can start by helping us alphabetize the donation cards. So, word on the street is you and Danielle might break up. Maybe. I don't know. Is that because of me? Not everything is about you. Would you stop that? Have you been thinking about me? Uh, no. Hey, do you need any help? Please, just pull up a chair. Oh, gosh. Oh, that's okay, I got it. Want to help with the seating cards? Sure. Do you want to tell me why you had your foot in John Rowland's crotch yesterday? Oh, that. Uh, he was helping me adjust the seam in my stocking, and from your angle, it must have looked a little weird. You're sleeping with him, aren't you? <laughs> okay. Yes, but you have to promise not to tell anybody. Gabrielle, he's in high school, and it's illegal, and you're married. If Carlos found out, this would kill him. It's just sex. It's totally harmless. How can you call something like this harmless? After everything you know about what I went through with Carl? This isn't about you. Yes, it is. It's about me and about every other person who was screwed over by somebody they loved. When Carl ran off with Brandy, you saw what a basket case I was. I was crying. I, I was tearing up his clothes. I couldn't get out of bed all day. You were right there. How could you do the same thing? Okay, how can you compare me to Carl? That's not fair. You have no idea what my life is like. Well, why don't you enlighten me? You're beautiful. You have more money than you can spend. And you have a husband who adores you. No, he doesn't adore me. He adores having me. That's a rationalization, and you know it. See you at the show. Okay, nanny. Nanny, you go. Nanny. How many nannies did you interview? Ten. Ten. Each one more incompetent than the last. One actually asked me, there you go, if she was expected to change diapers. Oh, good nannies are so hard to find. Yeah, that's why I was hoping to take advantage of your expertise. Oh, Lord. What do you want me to do? All your rich friends have nannies, A-list nannies. I need to catch one, here you go, without their bosses. Why? So I can poach me one. Lynette. Look, at my old job, we didn't wait for good people to come to us. We went out and raided other companies. I don't see why it should be different when you're hiring a nanny. I understand that good help is hard to find, but stealing a family's nanny is so it's unseemly. I'm not twisting anyone's arm. If I make a better offer, why shouldn't a qualified person reap the benefits? So, come on, where can I score some high-grade nanny? <laughs> <laughs>